hello dear friends welcome to my channels today's discussion is matrix multiplication so friends matrix multiplication is very very interesting and also inverse matrix we will discuss because this is the very prim basic but important because for the undergraduate students okay so i can write this way one two one minus one minus one zero one zero zero okay this is my value of a and now a square a square how can i find out a square i multiply one two one minus minus 1 and 0 1 0 0 multiply with a 1 minus 1 2 minus 1 1 0 and and 0 0 1 okay friends now it is the procedure is of matrix multiplication this way here is here okay you remember because you have to multiply 1 into 1 into 2 2 into minus 1 and 1 into 1 so what i get in the first first element 1 into 1 okay very basic but important minus 1 into 2 plus 1 cross 1 2 into 1 minus 1 into 2 okay minus 1 into 2 and 0 into 1 okay this way multiply this way this way and this way okay for better better understanding we need i just try to clear this total concept okay okay this way it is multiply so it is which row it is the, the, the matrix wise matrix this is the first row okay and first column okay so it is a one one a11 this is the first this is the second row and first column so element is this and 1 into 2 1 into 1 so it is 1 cross 1 plus 2 into 0 plus 0 into 1 and another way is minus 1 cross 1 and minus 1 into minus 1 so this way it is multiply so at first i remove this all the line because you can understand for your better understand i am trying to this do this that this portion minus 1 minus 1 and and minus 1 okay so minus 1 into minus 1 and plus 0 0 so it is the it is my second second column and first row so i get a 1 2 okay a 1 1 a 1 2 a 1 3 how can i get that i just discuss and minus 1 into 2 so i get minus 2 so multiplication is this way minus 1 into 2 minus 1 into 1 and 0 into 0 so minus 1 into minus 1 plus 0 so it is this row is is the second row and second column so it is a 2 2 okay this way it is procedure so i hope it is clear I hope it is clear. Okay. Okay, friends. Now, 
again i multiply guys you will you will check that minus 1 into minus 1 so it is minus 1 minus 1 and and 0 into 0 okay another is 1 into 1 so it is 1 plus 0 plus 0 so 1 into 2 2 plus 0 plus 0 1 into 1 1 plus 0 plus 0 so this is the total multiplication i hope it is clear for everyone based my multiplications now friends we see that i get a11 a12 a13 a2 a21 a22 a23 a31 a32 a33 so this multiplication so 1 into 1 1 and minus 2 and 1 so what value i get i get i get 0 okay and in here i get minus 1 plus 1 so it is 0 and now you see that 1 plus 0 plus 0 so it is 1 and 2 into 1 and minus 2 is equal to 0 so it is 0 minus 3 okay sorry in here i think that i okay i did some mistake okay minus 1 okay it is also minus 1 i have written wrong okay so it is also minus 1 so it is also minus 1 so minus 1 into minus 1 okay i have written wrong please correct correct this so 1 minus 1 into 2 and minus 1 into minus 1 plus 1 okay into 0 so it is this value equals to and another is minus 1 okay minus 1 it is 1 this is 1 value okay and this value is 2 into 0 is equal to 2, zero, zero, 2 and 1 so 1 to 1 0 minus 1 so what is the value preference you will check the total work okay uh, just so this way you get so this way you get this value a square is equal to 0 0 1 0 minus 1 comma 1 and 1 0 okay 0 minus 1 2 and 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 so this is the value phase now i have to prove that a square is equal to a inverse so inverse inverse so a square into a so i again i multiply a with a square okay So again, I square into a. So let's see zero one. So zero zero one and zero minus one and minus one. Okay, this way I can write and one. 2 1 okay so this is my a squared and a equals to a value is simple 1 2 1 and minus 1 minus 1 0 1 1 sorry 1 0 0 So 1 into 0, 2 into 0, 1 into 1. So this is 1. 1 into 0, 2 into minus 2 and this value is 0. And if you multiply, 0, 1. I hope that multiplications you 
can understand that 1 0 0 so 1 into 1 0 so it is 1 and 1 0 0 okay so i hope it is fine so it is clear that a square is equal to i so obviously a square is equal to a inverse thanks for watching